biomedical engineers have been around for a while. In fact, our program started at the University of Ghana, was the first to start 20 years ago. So they have been around and they have been doing something. However, it's been very difficult to incorporate enough practical experiences for our students over the years. And so what this project is going to do for the academic institutions specifically is to help us to look at our curricula, to introduce more practical experiences for our students and get them ready for the world of work. So that's what this project is going to do for us in the academic institutions. The project is targeting two universities. Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology, there's a biomedical engineering program there, and then also my own <laughs> department, the Department of Biomedical Engineering at the University of Ghana. These are the two institutions that have been targeted for this project. However, when we improve the teaching and learning of biomedical engineering in these institutions, we know that it's going to be extended to the other institutions as well because we do activities together, we learn from each other and so it's going to have wider impacts than this. In addition to this, um, the project is also going to target biomedical engineers who are working, you know, those in clinical practice and so what will happen is they will get uh, much more education and training on the work that they already do to improve our health uh, sector. This is a wonderful opportunity and I hope the students who are currently the beneficiaries uh, are going to appreciate this opportunity to improve what we already do. In fact, biomedical engineering is a very broad discipline, a very wide scope. Not all biomedical engineers become clinical engineers. The clinical engineers are a subset that work in our hospitals on medical devices in the hospitals. Uh, these are the ones that are going to benefit the most. So the students who decide to become clinical engineers should take advantage of the training that is going to be made available to them. They should see this as an opportunity to do even better than what their predecessors have done. Mm -hmm.